Father, you are holy indeed, and all creation rightly gives you praise. All life, all holiness comes from you through your Son, Jesus Christ, our Lord, by the working of the Holy Spirit. From age to age, you gather a people to yourself, so that from east to west, the perfect offering may be made to the glory of your name. And so, Father, we bring you these gifts. We ask you to make them holy by the power of your Spirit, that they may become the body and blood of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, at whose command we celebrate this Eucharist. On the night he was betrayed, he took bread and gave you thanks and praise. He broke the bread, he gave it to his disciples and said, Take this, all of you, and eat it. This is my body, which will be given up for you. When supper was ended, he took the cup. Again, he gave you thanks and praise. He gave the cup to his disciples and said, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. This is the cup of my blood, the blood of the new and everlasting covenant. It will be shed for you and for all, so that sins may be forgiven. Do this in memory of me. Christ is Lord of all ages. Lord, by your cross and resurrection, you have set us free. You are the Savior of the world. Father, calling to mind the death your Son endured for our salvation, his glorious resurrection and ascension into heaven, and ready to greet him when he comes again. We offer you in thanksgiving this holy and living sacrifice. Look with favor on your church's offering and see the victim whose death has reconciled us to yourself. Grant that we who are nourished by his body and blood may be filled with his Holy Spirit and become one body, one spirit in Christ. May he make us an everlasting gift to you and enable us to share in the inheritance of your saints with Mary, the Virgin Mother of God, with St. Joseph, the Apostles, the Martyrs, St. Athanasius, and all your saints, on whose constant intercession we rely for help. Lord, may the sacrifice which has made our peace with you advance the peace and salvation of all the world. Strengthen in faith and love your pilgrim church on earth, your servant, Pope Benedict, our Bishop Thomas, and all the bishops, with the clergy and the entire people your son has gained for you. Father, Hear the prayers of the family you have gathered here before you. In mercy and love, unite all your children wherever they may be. Welcome into your kingdom our departed brothers and sisters and all who have left this world in your friendship. We hope to enjoy forever the vision of your glory through Christ our Lord, from whom all good things come. Through him, with him, in him, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours, Almighty Father, forever and ever. Amen. 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 Let us pray with confidence to the Father as Jesus taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us. Lord, deliver us from every evil. Grant us peace in our day. In your mercy, keep us free from sin and protect us from all anxiety as we wait in joyful hope for the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. Lord Jesus Christ, you said to your apostles, I leave you peace, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church and grant us the peace and unity of your kingdom where you live forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be always with you. Let us offer each other a sign of peace.
This is Jesus, our Lord and Savior, the Lamb of God, who takes away our sins and the sins of the world. Happy are those who are called to his supper. Lord, I am not worthy to receive you, but only say the word, and I shall be healed. For those of you at home, join with me now in this act of spiritual communion. My Jesus, I believe that you are present in the Blessed Sacrament. I love you above all things, and I desire you in my soul. Since I cannot now receive you sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. As though you were already there, I embrace you and unite myself wholly to you. Permit not that I should ever be separated from you. Amen. Let us pray. All-powerful God, we join St. Athanasius in professing our belief in the true divinity of Christ, your Son. Through this sacrament, may our faith always give us life and protection. And we ask this in the name of Jesus the Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. Amen. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Mass is ended. Go in peace. Amen. Our thanks to a donor in Barrie, Ontario, whose generous contribution made the televising of today's Mass possible. If you're planning to attend the daily Mass at St. Basil's Church, it's important that you call our office at 1-888-383-6277 for details.